May Music Ministry this month. We filmed from the lounge room, so hope you enjoy it. And also, we have a big announcement to make. To you right, Andrew. Music Ministry is going live on the 4th of June. So we're putting an event on a night of music and fellowship. You're all invited, so please feel welcome to come. 4th of June, Unity College Steeple, 6 to 7 p.m. Hope to see everyone there. That's the announcement for now, so let's jump into worship for today. today we really wanted to have an opportunity to just have um, a casual chat in the lounge room um, about music and what music means to us personally and also what music means to us um, in our faith journey and even more so in the church so Matthew I know that you are a professional musician and you're studying music yourself so obviously and me too as a professional musician we're going to have a bias towards music but can you just sort of tell me in a few words what music 
really means to you. Yeah, thanks, Alex. Yeah, well, music's obviously obviously means a lot to me because I'm studying it, I'm performing it, I'm teaching it. it means a lot of a lot to my um, you know earthly life here, but I, I I know that God's called me into music for a, a spiritual reason. It's, you know, not just an earthly reason; it's actually a heavenly reason, and part of that is to reach out and reach other people. You know, other people with mm. the same joy mm. in in music, um, as we know, and we've sung earlier today, and we'll mm. sing later today. We mm. we sing praises to God because you know that's just mm. important, isn't Absolutely. that? Where, you know, well, it's, it's important to our faith. Exactly. I mean, it, it, it enables us to express our faith, I think, or express our our love for God and yeah. Well, he's, um, he's, yeah. he's saved us from mm. the grave, so it's mm. so important for me to, mm. to share that mm. love that comes from that by, yeah. and one, one of those ways for me is by by music. Yeah, yeah. and I, that's, I think that's what I really like about music, that um, God actually uses something that is can be perceived mainstream. I mean, let's face it, everyone either... Um, likes listening to music or has their favourite band or um, heads off to a concert. I mean, you don't have to be a musician or study music to appreciate music in your life. And I think when we start looking at it, music in that sense, he's using something that everybody has in their life in one way or another. Um, you know, you think about, you, you get married, what do you have? Music. music yeah. um, at a funeral, what do you have? Music. music. You need to get pumped up ready for your football game. What do you use? Music. It just goes on and on and on. It, it, music is really a, um, a common factor of life. Um, and so when we start talking about how music enables us to worship and praise and you know, express our faith, um, and we sort of compare that back to music being a normal aspect of life. It's a, mm. a really interesting comparison that, um, you know, one thing could be such a high, you know, out there thing and at the same time such a normal everyday today thing. Um, Matthew, you spoke about how um, music impacts, you know, your ability to, to worship and praise, but... Um, can you sort of tell us a little bit more about maybe, you know, what the Bible might say about about music um, or, yeah, just a little bit more, more detail? Yeah, well... Sorry to put you on the spot. <laughs> no, I did prepare some stuff earlier. Oh, good. So I've had, had a look. <laughs> Hence had, the Bible sitting on your lap. <laughs> yeah, I've got two, pa two pages out here, but uh, Psalms is a good one. So mm, Psalms, yes. there's a lot of Psalms that talk about music. I've, I've got a couple here. Um, and Psalm 98, verse 4 to 6 says, Shout to, sorry, shout for joy mm. to the Lord, all the earth. Burst into jubilant song with music. Make music to the Lord with the harp, uh, with the sound of singing, with trumpets and the blast of the ram's horn. Shout for joy before the Lord, the King. Mm. And um, Psalm 150 says, Praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him for Praise him, uh, sorry, praise him in his mighty heavens, praise him for his acts of power, praise him for his surpassing greatness. And then it talks about all the instruments mm -hmm. to praise, and I'm sure there's more that are not listed here, but praise him with the sounding trumpets, harp, lyre, timbrel. I don't know that one, Alex. But... A drum, I think. Oh, thank oh, you. Oh, is it, is it a, um, a guitar more thing? Oh, oh gosh, well, I've really got to go it. back to school on that um, one. <laughs> and dancing... Praise him with the strings and pipe. Praise him with the clash of cymbals. Praise him with the resounding cymbals. Let everything that has breath mm. praise the Lord. Mm. So there you go. Yeah, and um, you did ask me before we went on to this session about where do I look for some, you know, proof about, you know, music in the Bible. And I said, head to the Psalms. And, you know, if you want to read more about that and you want to, you know, understand yeah. music and how God um, values music, uh, the Psalms is a great one for that because David, the musician, uh, it's all through there. Um, and I've also had this revelation over the last sort of 12 months about how much God does value music. We often think about, you know, it's us worshipping God through song and music. And we sort of, um, 
it's been really interesting how God has revealed to me that he was the first, he is, he, he loves music, he values music. Uh, in the Bible here, Zephaniah, it speaks about how the Lord your God is with you. He is mighty to save. He will take great delight in you. He will quiet you with his love. And he will rejoice over you with singing. I just love that imagery that it is our God who sings over us. You know, we often think it's just all about us singing to him. But God values music so much that he um, sings over us. Uh, he is the first musician and he'll be the last musician. And that gives me just such great imagery and such great comfort of, you know, knowing who a little bit more about who my God is. So thanks once again for joining us. I think we're going to leave it there for today. Thanks so much, Matthew, for your um, chat and your words of um you know, insight into what music means to you and, and how that impacts our faith life as well, but just more so how it impacts our life in general. So we hope and pray that you too can find the joy that comes from music. Um, and uh, we pray that, yeah, you would enjoy music more and more every day. See you later. Just to breathe.
Thanks for watching everybody. Really hope you enjoyed the video today. Also, don't forget, we've got Music Ministry Live in the steeple, June 4th. If you want more information about that, check out our Facebook page. See ya. See you later.